So the, there is such a challenge in the world today because with the internet and the iPhone and being connected so readily, the commercial perception of sexuality is pornography. Mm -hmm. Pornography. Pornography, you know, uh, erotic sex can be fun, but pornography is sex without beauty, sex without loving connection. Mm -hmm. And it's dominating sexuality, is one dominating against the other. One of my very early Buddhist Tantra teachers said, anything in sex is fine, anything, anything in sexuality is okay, so long as you do not harm another. Do not harm another physically, emotionally or spiritually. If we don't harm each other, if we can think of not harming each other physically, emotionally or spiritually, that is a big call. You must be the highest, highest, highest developed person. Because if I do something with you and it harms you physically on your body, it's bad karma. Emotionally, bad karma. Spiritually, if I harm you, is bad karma. So pornography harms physically, emotionally and spiritually. It's the worst karma. Mm -hmm. And then so much of this is available in the world. Everywhere. Everywhere. In New Zealand, for the high school boys, in Australia, in Europe, Africa, America, South America, Asia. Everywhere. Oh, it's so bad. Because young people do not have a choice if they see the pornography. They just get their, uh, you know, their, their brain systems get hooked into the excitement. Their hormones get hooked into the excitement. So this is harming physically. Emotionally it harms them because they can't sustain a relationship for very long. It harms them emotionally as well and it harms them spiritually because we should do no harm to any other living human being. This is the Buddhist way. So I think Buddhist Tantra is very, very important. And I think Tantra that teaches love and respect is the best thing. So we must have more Tantra teachings that teach love and respect mm -hmm. for each other, whether a male or female, whether 65 years of age or 10 years of age, to, to teach this so people can be free, totally free, away from the um, conditioning of the internet, away from conditioning of other people, to be free in themselves like a child, unharmed, and to explore and grow in their sexuality especially with a beloved. Mm -hmm. Namaste.